guys it is that time again time to say hi how you're doing you're keeping well you're keeping safe what's new what's popping um i just excuse my whole appearance right now i got up at 1 30 this morning for work suffice to say i am pretty much shattered right about now I think it's about half ten in the morning. I'm just going to do this real quick because I know some of you are excited to see uh, the new products. But I am most definitely going back to bed very shortly. I am absolutely shattered. But five more shifts left at my current job and then I am done. No more getting up at 1.30 in the morning. No more having my daughter stay at other people's houses for a couple of nights because of these shifts. No more people yelling at me because they can't travel because of COVID. No more, just, just no more. I'm just, I'm just 100% done with it. And I am so excited to be leaving. I've just had enough. I'm just done. So that's it. Five more shifts. Uh, I'm going to miss some people, you know. I'm going to miss some uh, close friends that I've made. I obviously met my girlfriend there. Um, it is very much the people that keep you at this job rather than the job itself. Um, the people make the job enjoyable. Does that make sense? Um, so yeah, gonna miss gonna miss a few people. Excuse me, but uh, all for the better, and all for the right reasons. Um, and uh, you know what they say: if they're true friends, they'll stick around, right? They'll get in touch. So I'm not expecting to, to hear from any of them, because that's just the way my life goes. I always seem to make friends really easy, but then they never stick around. Um, yeah, and we've had a recent example of that, so, hey-ho, um, had some cool things going on, yesterday we went to Drusilla's, which is a kind of zoo-type place, with a couple of rides, and some, like, soft play, and, like, a bit of a water park, uh, and that was pretty cool, what else have we done? We went to, um, we have a massive shopping mall in the UK called Blue Water. So we went there on Wednesday, today is Saturday. So Wednesday we went there and we played mini golf with my daughter who's four and a half, which was awesome. Um, a bit boring for her, you know, once she's hit it, she thinks that's it and you can just move on. Um, doesn't really occur to her that you've got to get the whole, the ball in the hole. I'm so sorry, I'm delirious right now. Uh, and then um, I rented some sort of electronic boat thing, so kind of like a pedalo without the pedals. And we went on the boating lake for about half an hour. And it was just really, really nice. I'll pop some photos at the end of the video just to show you guys what it looked like. We managed to have glorious weather, although we're having a bit of a crappy summer in the UK right now, uh, despite I am sunburnt from yesterday at Drusilla's, which was gorgeous weather. Um, yeah, it's been, it's been a really nice couple of days off, so it's been really nice to do that. Just before my daughter goes to stay with her dad for a couple of days while I do these ridiculous shifts. Um, so yeah, but I digress, like I say, five more left. So, this one is for my water drop peeps, where you at? I know you're there always in the background somewhere waiting for these videos to pop up um i received this the day before yesterday but the clause in the contract with my girlfriend is you are not allowed to use your new bottle until i have done a video on it so i'm half doing it because that's what i do now i review water drop goods and half doing it because she wants to use a new bottle and it's just a bit mean having it sit there looking at us on our desk uh when i can just shoot this 10 15 minute video to show you guys what it looks like it is beautiful it's beautiful um so first things first if you've not tried vibe get on it get get on vibe i mean it's it's literally the summer drink okay you know there's like a summer anthem when there's a new song comes out and there's like a summer blockbuster when a new movie comes out 
this is the new summer drink vibe it's absolutely gorgeous i managed to try it when they released it a couple of months ago and they just released it for like 48 hours or whatever it was i managed to get two boxes then i'm just gonna keep yawning i'm so sorry and uh managed they still have it now it's on sale but the uh the discount code doesn't work anymore but it's eight pound 90 so it's a special edition uh, limited edition although it doesn't say that anymore so maybe it's becoming permanent although it's still £8.90 so it's a bit you get 12 12 bottles 12 drinks out of it but it is absolutely gorgeous if you like uh it's just refreshing I wouldn't say you could taste the rosemary and I wouldn't say you could taste the mint and I wouldn't say you can necessarily taste the phasalias but it's just all together really really tasty drink and they're selling it now for a couple of weeks i guess until they run out so we got one two we don't want to run out for a while three i think three just three boxes we were we were you know we were good like that let some people try it so there's some vibe which we love uh defense is another one of my girlfriend's favorites i'm not too keen on this one I don't know what the general consensus is out there. Uh, cranberry, rose hip and moringa. It's not one of my favourites. I don't particularly like it. Uh, but she likes it. Definitely, I am a clean girl. I love this. Um, I know it reminds people of like gin and tonic. However, I don't like gin and tonic. Uh, herbs, juniper berry and nettle. I don't know if I can taste any specific ingredient in that list. But I just like the way it's refreshing. I like the colour. I mean, the colours are amazing. Um, my favourite colour is turquoise, so this packaging is right up my alleyway. Um, yeah, I just like the refreshing taste of clean. It is really nice, especially on a day like today, maybe, where I'm going to be feeling a bit tired later on, even though I'm going to have a bit of a snooze. Um, I might make a litre of clean to just sort of wake up the senses a little bit, wake me up after my nap. And uh, I go from there. Oh. oh. So, if you paid attention to the uh, vibe release you will have noticed some accessories that came out and of course your girl can't go without her accessories okay and i'm that kind of partner that if i get myself an accessory you know i'm gonna get you one okay so i used my reward points on my girlfriend because i'm nice like that and my bottle was smaller therefore it was cheaper so i paid for my bottle got her bottle for free that's just how I work. It happened like that with Sky when the Sky bottles came out. Her bottle was more expensive, so I used my points on her bottle. And my bottle was smaller, so it was cheaper, so I paid for my bottle. That's just how it seems to rock and roll in my life. I don't drink an awful lot of water. I never have done. These make it easier, don't get me wrong. They make it easier, they make it better. But I still don't want more than like six, seven hundred mils in one go. And I do not drink warm water. My water has to be cold, ice cold. Otherwise, I don't want to know. So if I don't drink it all relatively quickly after it's been made, I'll leave it. Literally, this video is just going to be me yawning. And I am so, so, so sorry. I probably should have slept before. But my girlfriend finishes at 12. She'll be home about half 12, quarter to one. And then we'll both snooze. And then this video will not be done for another day. So I just want to get it out there. And I apologise for all the yawning. You can see I am absolutely shattered. So let's go with the first one, shall we? This bad boy right here is absolutely gorgeous. Um, what one is this? I don't even know. Um, large velvet. I believe this one is called velvet velvet we're going with it says on the um invoice so what they are no longer doing at old water drop is putting the numbers of the lids that they make on the lid which i find slightly ridiculous but i digress here is your bottle it's just beautiful and this was illustrated by Raxen Maniquiz. Maniquiz, Maniquiz. There you go. Let me take the glass bottle out for you to have a better look at it. It is gorgeous. This is not mine, remember, this is my girlfriend's. Um, just the colours are just absolutely popping. I love the blues that they're putting in with the vibe bottles that you're getting now. 
and it's just gorgeous and this is a one litre bottle so it's too much for me I will not drink a litre of water um, the sleeve is quite cool itself you you always get a sleeve of a glass bottle usually you always usually do so that's the one litre bottle and that was called velvet I do believe all of these are still on sale however the discount code does not work anymore my bad boy now I am in love in love with dragonflies I absolutely adore the things don't ask me why I couldn't tell you why maybe it's their short lifespan Maybe it's the way they're just more graceful than butterflies. They don't seem like they're panicking and freaking out in your face. I don't know what it is, but I absolutely love dragonflies. I had a tattoo of a dragonfly, but it had gone wrong and kind of splayed under the skin, so I got it covered up. But well done, Waterdrop, for finally making a bottle with these bad boys on it. I mean, it's, oh, it's just, I'm so happy right now. And to make matters even better... It's a 400ml bottle. So it's teeny tiny. Teeny tiny bottle. And it's just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Let's show you guys the bottle itself. Look at that. Those dragonflies are popping, huh? Again, nice bluey, greeny colours. I'm a little bit upset that the lid, I don't know if you can see that, but it's come scuffed. So, not amazing. But, um, nevertheless, the bottle is gorgeous. And yeah, 400 mils. So, that may be a bit too strong to put a water drop in it. I think for, I usually put a water drop in six to 700 mils of water. So, I haven't yet tried it. Obviously, I haven't used it yet because I haven't turned you guys. That's what I do first. But I will have to pop a, a, a probably a Vibe in here. I feel like Vibe is something that I can drink stronger than the other drops. Maybe a Merry. Maybe, oh, maybe a Youth. Because I love my peach and ginger at the moment. So maybe I will, I will try the 400ml with a drop in it to see how strong it is. And see if I like it. Um, because I'm used to having them a lot weaker than, than this. But I just love how small that is. It's so compact. It's actually it's so lightweight. And it's it's just it's just so gorgeous and dinky like me. I'm five foot two, so this is just this is beautiful, and I am absolutely loving the dragonfly print on it. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. These bottles, I mean, it was hard to choose. To be fair, I could have bought one of every bottle because they are just beautiful. So if you've not checked out Water Drops Vibe Drop. Check it out because they're still on sale. You can still get them, I believe. I think some have already sold out. Some of the... Um, it's usually the bigger bottles that sell out. You do the one litre. But, uh... There you have it. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. So, and the sleeve is amazing. I'm going to send a picture of that lid to Water Drop and just see what's happening with that. Because it is... A bit scuffed. You can see in places up here and down here. So that's not great considering you pay nearly £30 for a bottle like this. And it comes scuffed. So my um and my gel thing was pierced. So all of the balls fell out and they're all in there. And now they're all in there. Um so yeah, when I first heard my box come through the it didn't come through the door, but when my girlfriend opened the door, I thought that was like a broken bottle or something i really was fearing the worst all of it came intact aside from like a little bit of a scratch lid um so i'm very happy with that order and that is gorgeous it is a gorgeous gorgeous order um so there you have it my bottle was called orchid the big bottle was called velvet then we had defense vibe and clean and it came to about 56 pounds because I use my um, reward points. Very important to cash in on your reward points. Um, and that's it really. It wasn't a massive order. I could have spent way more money. I could have got a beach towel. A beach bag. If you spent over 120 quid. You qualified for a bag and a towel. But. Our summer is shocking. Because of Covid I don't plan on going anywhere. Um, managed to get hold of the picnic blanket. I love the picnic blanket. Um, that was definitely. A, a good decision to make but the beach towel and the beach bag 
I feel like you can just kind of take a tote bag with you. You don't necessarily specifically need a beach bag. Or if you do, you can go to like Amazon or Primark or something like that in the UK and just pick up a beach bag for like a fiver. Whereas these bags are sort of nearing on 30 quid. Uh, same again, they released a Vibe cocktail shaker because there's a Vibe cocktail that is um, alcohol and non-alcohol. And the shaker, again, was about 25, 26 quid. And we bought one for £11 off Amazon. And it's just, you can get hung up with water drop and their items. While they are beautiful and they're gorgeous, they are very, very expensive. So don't think for a second that you can't substitute something. So if, by all means, get your glass bottles. But then if there's a shaker or something that's on sale and it's nice, but you can get a replacement for just as nice, Go get the replacement. Um, I mean, I'm all for water drop. I absolutely love them. They've helped, helped me out massively with my fluid intake because seriously, I was awful. I was I was probably one of the worst. I would barely drink more than a cup of tea a day. So the fact that I'm getting down a litre bottle and maybe a little bit more of water or juice and some gunner, obviously, have been amazing. And uh, just some squash every every now and again. It's it's more water than I've ever drunk in my life, and that's down to water drop. So, wholeheartedly thank them for that forever. But when it comes to their extras, as gorgeous as they are, they are very very expensive. So just be careful with your funding because that's something that we learned very early on was that we could get a bit caught up with it, and we have, and uh, and now we're still paying off visa bills and stuff because of it. But we wanted the shaker, but the shaker that was on Amazon was glass, not steel. And it has recipes all the way down the side. And it's just, it's just gorgeous. Whereas the, the one on water drop is just steel. So there's no recipes. There's no aesthetically pleasing look to it. It's just a water drop shaker. So same with the ice, ice tray molds. They, they look great. And I love the premise that they were long and thin so that they could stick in a bottle. But again, they wanted nearly 20 pounds for an ice cube tray. And I'm all for businesses making money and, and releasing products that are different and colourful and gorgeous. But please don't charge the earth for them because people are going to run out of money and shop elsewhere. And you're just not going to make as much as you would do if you didn't charge as much. But this was um, this was a no-brainer. As soon as I saw this was dragonflies, um, it was a no-brainer. I had to have it. So I'm going to get in touch with Waterdrop regarding the lid because I'm not massively impressed that it's scuffed when you pay that much for it. I'm going to head back to bed, catch up on some zeds, and then uh, see where the afternoon takes us. We are off to Harry Potter World in September. I believe it's September the 25th. Uh, my girlfriend got it for my birthday present in April. And I am so excited. Now that the world is opening up a little bit more, I feel like with double vaccines, we can kind of relax a little bit more now. If we get it, it's still going to suck, but it shouldn't suck as bad. And we should not need health care in a hospital. And that is essentially the main reason our NHS was struggling big time with cases. And we've been to the theatre and touch wood. It's, it's over two weeks. It's, it's over two weeks. It's a week and a half since we've been touch wood. We are all fine. We're all healthy. We had our masks on for the majority of the time. If we had it off, we were eating or drinking. And it was just so good to be back in a theatre again. And obviously our days out like Drusilla's, this was all closed in the UK. And now it's all opening up a little bit more. It was very busy yesterday, but because it's mainly an outside attraction, you could kind of keep your distance a little bit and kind of just take your time, maybe walk faster or walk a bit slower to make sure you weren't were in people's way. And it was, it was a good day out. And yeah, because things are starting to get back to normality a little bit, I am very, very, very much looking forward to going to Harry Potter World again. I've been twice, I believe, um, and I love it. And they've added some more things to the exhibition. So um, the last time I went, the train was there, but you couldn't go in the dark forest. There was no dark forest. There was no um, Gringotts Bank. So I'm very excited to do that again, especially with my girlfriend. We are currently going back through the Harry Potter films in order, and she's not seen them. So I think we are on movie number three or four. I feel like we've watched three. So I think we're on four, which I believe in my opinion is probably the best one. Um, 
don't quote me because as we're going back through them again, I'm remembering more bits that I used to love. I saw all of them in the cinema as a kid and I loved Harry Potter. Not really a kid, more like a early 20s adult. Um, so yeah, I will no doubt film a load of that when we go and put it up on YouTube because there are some people in other countries that I talk to. You may not be able to get over to London to come to Harry Potter World and if you're a Harry Potter fan, you 100% want to go to this to this place. It's where they filmed most of Harry Potter. So I'm very excited to go. September 25th. It's still a while away. I've still got five or six weeks. Got to start my new job first. Got to get my daughter started in school. And then life will become a bit more like routine for me. And I can just chill and just enjoy it. Rather than looking like this. So that was your water drop vibe order. Just a small one from me. Um, obviously I've done a lot bigger orders than this, but, um, it's all about money now, being a bit clever. I want everything that they've ever sold. All right. There's no lie. Um, their stuff is absolutely gorgeous. And if I had all the money in the world, no doubt I would be buying everything that they do. But, um, it's just not feasible. It's just not feasible for the price and nobody needs that many water bottles. You know what I'm saying? I just, I just like them. So they're there when I want to use them. So that's it. Drink more water. I did do. There's a QR code down there. You scan that. Pause the video if you want it. Scan it. I will put the um, the website in the description. Not that you need it because I've done. Somebody tell me in the comments how many water drop videos I've done. Seven, six, seven. I've done a few, and that's the majority of where you guys have come from. Am I wrong? You've come from Water Drop. So I love that. Thank you guys so much for the continued support. Subscribing on my channel, commenting, saying hi. I absolutely love it. I get back to you guys as soon as I can. Any questions, any comments, anything you'd want to see me do, anything like that. And please don't say do a video when you're less tired because that was a given and I apologise for the yawning. I feel like I'm over it now. But I'm 100% going back to bed. I think I was cold. I think that's why I was yawning. I was cold. I put the heating on. In August, I put the heating on. But um, need to warm up from the inside out, you know. So stay safe. Stay well. Subscribe to my channel if you don't mind. Comment on this video if you like. Um, if I can get another discount code or there's something that I hear of, I will pop it in the description box for you guys. I'll see you soon.